Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. In today's video, I'll be sharing my thoughts on Martin Mayer, which is a Haven site in Blackpool. I'll be discussing all aspects of the site, including entertainment, accommodation, the food, facilities and more. So if you're interested, then keep on watching. Firstly, I'll start with sharing just some basics of our holiday at Martin Mayer. We stayed Monday to Friday in early May and we stayed in a three bedroom gold caravan. We originally booked to have a two bed, but for some reason, when we got to our caravan, they gave us a three bed. But I'm not complaining. That spare room was actually really, really helpful to store the baby stroller and things like that in there. So not complaining at all. Okay, so prior to our check-in date, Haven were really good at communicating with us over emails and text messages about what to expect on the site and the checking in process, which was fab. The check-in process itself was really easy, quick and simple. For those wondering, there's no need to go to reception to check in. What Haven do is they actually give you an arrival time, which is a one hour slot. Ours was between 12 and 1 p.m. When you arrive, you simply check in with a staff member at the security entrance gate and then go straight to the caravan where you'll find your keys along with your welcome pack. After that, they do prompt you to fill out a very short questionnaire through the app about the cleanliness of your accommodation. Just a heads up to do with the app, Haven actually do a lot of things through the app now. So if you are able to download them onto your phone, that would possibly make things easier for you. There's two apps available for Haven. One is called My Haven, which is for all of your basic holiday needs and information. And the other is called Haven Serve, which you use if you want to order food whilst you're on site. But yes, very impressed with how easy check-in was. I'll talk about accommodation next. We stayed in a three-bed gold caravan, as I'd mentioned previously. Our caravan was number 28, Lake Mere View. It was spotlessly clean, very impressive. It looked as though it was a relatively new caravan as well, which is always a bonus. I did a video tour of the caravan if you'd be interested. I'll leave it in the description box down below for you. We had everything we needed and more in that caravan. I could have lived there, to be honest. It was absolutely beautiful and it had beautiful views over the lake as well. Speaking of the lake, the site is in a lovely location. There's a nature reserve on the site that guests can walk around, which is gorgeous. You're a quick 10 minute drive into the center of Blackpool too. So it's great if you wanna use the site as a base to visit Blackpool's attractions. Just a quick word about the Haven apps that I mentioned earlier. They are very easy to use. We ordered food through Haven Serve and we constantly used the My Haven app. Very useful to have for your holiday. Facilities on site are very good. There's an indoor swimming pool, a small outside lazy river, a pretty fast water slide, an arcade. You can hire stuff as well. Plus on top of all of that, there's loads of activities that you can participate in. Some of them are free. Some of them you do have to pay an additional fee for though. So do bear that in mind. I personally thought the selection of activities and the facilities were very good and everywhere was clean. Please bear in mind that at the time of recording this video, we had to book activities in advance, like for example, with the swimming. If you wanna access the swimming pool whilst you're there, you can't just turn up, you have to pre-book. On site, there's a few different places to eat at. There's the Boathouse restaurant, which we didn't actually visit, so I can't comment on that. There's a fish and chip shop, which we ate at on our first night. It was lovely, to be honest, nice and hot and not too badly priced either. The portion sizes were fine for us, even though we had read reviews complaining about the portion sizes. There's also a Burger King on site, which we ate at a few nights later. The Burger King was nice, but I will say that both mine and my mum's food were cold, but my husband said his was warm. Prices weren't too bad considering the location, the fact you're on a Haven site. Um, but to be honest, after all of that with Burger King, I would order from there again. And I would also definitely order from the fish and chip shop again. Entertainment is varied and there's enough to keep families occupied. One night we saw a show called Pop Factory and we did a quiz. Another night there were a singer on. Uh, game shows were on a lot too. Every morning there was both tots and junior events too. What I thought was particularly good was a show all about being safe in the water, which was aimed at the kids. Bingo for adults only was also on every single day, but we never actually went to play. 
Overall, I definitely enjoyed my stay at Marta Mia and I definitely would return there. It's in a great location. The caravan we had was gorgeous. Everything was clean and hygienic. The facilities were fab. Entertainment was good. All of the staff we encountered were very polite and helpful and both of the apps were easy and simple to use. So have you been to Martin Mia and if so what were your thoughts on it let me know in the comments section down below. Thank you so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it leave it a thumbs up and please do consider subscribing to the channel to stay up to date with my future uploads. Thanks for watching yet again and I hope to see you in my next video.